So the topic of today's sermon is the value of being poor. In my journeys, I've been going to Thailand, sometimes across the United States, and meeting a lot of different people. And I've met a lot of people. Some people were poor, some people were middle class, lower middle class, upper middle class, some people were very wealthy. And all these people had different personalities. But one thing that I noticed was most of the people who were first generation rich, they all came from being poor. And they had a different work ethic. They worked hard, they woke up early, they did their work, they finished their work, they had a lot of morals and values, and they, were, they seemed to have a lot of life lessons. They seemed to have a lot of information to pass on to other people. But when we met the people who were second generation rich, third generation rich, you noticed that they were more focused on having fun, more focused on spending the money, and all they talked about was the best brands, the best fun things, the pl best places to go. And herein lies the dilemma. Everyone wants to be rich. Everyone wants to have that money and have that power. But what people don't see is the value of being poor. From being poor, you learn to live with what you have. You learn to adapt to your current situations. You learn about the dark side of life. You learn about the difficulties of life and you have a lot of perspective. All these things aid your soul. They make you wiser, they make you stronger. Now, in this case, we're talking about money, poor or wealthy, but it works the same way in terms of suffering. When you have a lot of suffering, you learn about life fast. You've seen in the YouTubes and the, in the internet where kids that were like six, seven years old lost their parents, or some people who were handicapped lost a leg, lost an arm, and they fought through life. And when they came out, they were much more adults, much more stronger, more intelligent, more worldly. And they made less mistakes later. And so it becomes a thing where people who are in bad situations, people who are poor, people who are in a suffering situation, do not look at your situation as if it's purely negative because everyone who has come out of those situations, they come out stronger. And so this is not necessarily an opportunity, but it's your choice. Do you wanna live in the poverty? Do you wanna live in the pain and suffer and have a hellish experience? Or do you wanna learn from it and grow and become strong? It's your choice which way you take it. And this is, in, this is where the value of being poor or suffering or negative things happen. It's the opportunity to create strength. But a lot of people, it's hard to create strength when you're wealthy. It's hard to create motivation when you have everything. It's hard to fight when you already have it. But when you don't, and when you're suffering, you have to. And therein lies the value of being poor. So for us, look at our lives. Look at our situation. Anything that you see as a disadvantage, make it into an advantage. Make it into a learning experience to strengthen your soul.